And it's nothing more magical than to see them graduate knowing within months they'll have their own classrooms. Bright-eyed and full of ideas, Dr. Rosemary Allen loves how her students at MSU Denver, future teachers, see the world. They are convinced that they can change the world in one generation. But the next generation of teachers is graduating into an uncertain and often scary world where lockdown drills are a part of school life, just like math class, and school shootings are no longer infrequent. But one of the things that I tell my students who are going to be teachers is that we can't control every variable. And Shootings are not just happening at school, but we have to be vigilant. We have to keep our students safe. You have the added responsibility of 20 to 30 children in your classroom. And while it's not what we signed up for, unfortunately in America right now, this is status quo. A survey by the Colorado Education Association found nearly 70% of teachers are very or somewhat worried about a mass shooting at their school. Educators have told us these fears have many considering leaving the profession. So we can't afford for what's happening today to scare teachers out of the workforce. Dr. Allen hopes the next generation of teachers will stay, stay, and really make a difference. And we have to be vigilant wherever we are so that we, so we don't give up our dreams of teaching because of a fear of shooting, especially because they take place anywhere. Dr. Allen's also the Nine News racial equity expert, and she said there are so many other big picture things we really have to prepare teachers for. Trauma-informed care, how to work within diverse classrooms, understanding how kids develop and addressing challenging behaviors equitably. All of this stuff is really important, and this is the stuff they can and should understand upon the, their graduations where they can really make an impact, guys. Don't pay teachers a whole lot, ask a whole lot of them, and then now to hear that people, you know, don't feel safe, worry about their own personal safety. It's a lot to put on anybody. It is, it is, and I, I don't know if there's an easy solution, but at least I think they're starting to understand when they graduate, this might be in front of them mm -hmm. a little bit. Yep, Jennifer Meckles, thank you.